all right guys i have started recording today we are going to discuss ims goa related questions okay this is a technical discussion for ims goa related question all the question which has been earlier asked and recently what has been told by ims goa director that these are to the topics that can come from this this topic that the questions can come so we will be covering that also and since we had decided to cover today uh, is air compressor boilers and fluid mechanics so we will be covering air compressor question in one part in second part boilers in third part total three video will be making this recording session so that in uh, after meeting or after that you can refer this recording whatever discussion we are having and since i was talking about uh, my experience with uh, uh, different different uh, like people who has appeared for uh ims goa and synergy and anglo what i got to know uh, about interview thing is that if you talk about anglo anglo they have certain sets of question and from that sets of question they ask question and you need to be perfect for every questions for them so uh, uh, for that uh, anglo is like that only there are certain and talking about uh, synergy ims goa great eastern and other exams this exam don't have a certain pattern like they asked from this this two question okay they are having a, this interviewer name he will ask this question this sets of question from this sets of question so uh, in that case what we discovered that uh, at last when you are not feeling blank in front of interviewer you don't have to be perfect like if he asked this question you need to be perfect to explain that concept just like in anglo you don't need to be but you need to so know something that you can speak up in front of interviewer with confidence so don't so much worry about guys because we have a lot of lots of question for ims goa because uh, uh, for anglo we have mostly more more to more 50 sets of question but for ims goa we have at least uh, more than 150 question and it is approx 200 questions we are going to discuss along with the topics so guys you need to know little little thing for every uh, concept from every concept so you don't have uh, don't get blank in the front of interviewer kamlesh brother you got my point yeah yes okay amston got it yes yes okay so uh, without wasting any time let's get started with the air compressor so we have uh, sets of question for air compressor we are the format is like that i will be asking you the questions and everyone whatever you know okay you need to speak okay doesn't matter you know right or wrong we will discuss but you need to speak so guys starting with the first question of air compressor classification of air compressor who is going to be first amston go ahead If you can switch on your camera, it would be good, otherwise, no worries. Some background noise, okay. Kamlesh, brother. Uh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Can. So, yeah. see. For my base knowledge, there are two main types one is reciprocating. And the second is a uh, root band in which we have like a centrifugal compressor. In a reciprocating compressor, there are single acting cylinders, uh, single acting compressor, double acting compressor. Uh, after that, we have uh, multi series compressor as well, mm -hmm. uh, such as combination of multiple cylinders. And also, we have uh, uh, low type compressors or screw type compressor, which are generally is being used in superchargers. Correct. Anyone wanna add in this? 
गाइस आफ्टर लॉन्ग वी आर स्टार्टिंग अगेन टेक्निकल सेशन यू मस्ट हैव इफ यू हैव नॉट सीन यू प्लीज सी ऑल ऑफ अवर अर्लियर टेक्निकल सेशन हाउ मस्ट वी यूज टू पार्टिसिपेट सिंस आई एम ऑलरेडी सिटिंग इन द जी एम ई कॉलेज फॉर ट्रेनिंग नाउ इट्स योर टर्न गाइज माई फ्रेंड्स टेक पार्टिसिपेट विनायक मिस्टर गोदी आर यू देर also we are using uh, compressors on board ship to compress air for starting of our main engines correct okay. uh, from that in our day to day life we are using compressors for various purposes uh, like uh, we use uh, compressors in paint booth to power our paint guns then we use in tire shops etc yeah these are the two main thing in refrigerator we use this compressor on board ship for cranking yeah. in, in engine uh, on the spots coming answer okay amston what you will say if this question would be asked to you can you hear me yeah yeah i can hear you Yeah, I would say turbo charger, uh, turbo charger. Yeah, Then correct. I would say reefer system, reefer mm-hmm. system, wherein the compressor used to compress the refrigerant. And also for the air compressor, wherein, uh, yeah, these these are the three I would say. No worries, all good. Yeah, in turbo charger we have uh, turbine uh, connected with the turbines are connected with the compressor. Correct. What is meant by two stage compressor? Amston, you go ahead. Guys, you can raise your hand if you want to answer. So you can see me, Gam. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. So we have a so two stage means first we compress it to some uh, some pressure like from one bar. We take a suction of the atmospheric uh, pressure of air and then we compress it to a intermediate pressure. Later on with the intercooler. we cool the uh, compressed air and then it is fed to a next compressor wherein it uh, increases pressure to more higher level so this is how a two stage compressor works so after the second compressor we have a after cooler which cools the uh, compressed air before being sent to the air bottle so this is how a air compressor works two stage two stage air compressor works uh, anyone else what is meant by two stage compression in compressor okay raj uh, raj tandel yeah go ahead uh, hello gyan yeah, yeah first of all we uh, we can uh, pressurize air at a low stage and then just go to the intercooler and uh, at air is cool down and temperature is low that's why it is easy to compress again and then and it will compress at high stage after intercooler and then it will go to the after cooler and then for the purpose what, what we where we require yeah well tried uh, kamlesh brother uh, sure so let's say you have to compress air from 1 bar to 30 bars hmm. you can use the, you do that using your regular compressor with a single piston so you have to uh, like compressor we have compression ratio of 30 is 2 okay hmm. so uh, in case of multi stage compressor we'll have two pistons first one will be a low pressure piston and second one will be high pressure piston so first first piston will compress the gases from uh, at 1 bar to let's say up to 5 bars Okay. After 
after first low pressure test and uh, this compressor passes through the intercooler where it, it drops its temperature and at constant pressure when you lose temperature uh, the volume will be reduced okay so then this uh, compressed gas is then fed to the high pressure cylinder which will compress it from like 5 bar to next uh, 30 that is okay. the 25 bars of compression you can also tell by the example on board ship we use two stage compressor first uh, we make it the air pressure on 5 bar okay then we, in mm -hmm. the second stage we make it 30 bar so uh, yeah why we do it to reduce the work done to get the more amount of exactly. air in the bottle yeah, i was coming to that afterwards okay so uh, so by incorporating the intercooler you are reducing temperature so it reduces the work done which is required to compress the gas from 1 bar to uh, 30 bars so instead of using a single cylinder by using multi stage uh, cylinder you are uh, saving a lot of work done uh, like a uh, lot of uh, operating cost also uh, you can reduce the manufacturing cost because uh, while if you are using a single cylinder you have to make it very bulky and strong but yeah, if you are using two cylinders you can reduce the material cost on that and also the size is reduced yeah correct guru kripa uh... Uh, you raised hand. You wanna say something? Yes, bro. Yeah, go ahead. So basically, uh, two stage compressor. There are two stages. First stage, in uh, which we are compressing air to one bar to five bar. These are low pressure compressor. From where we are uh, entering five bar pressure into intercooler, through which we are cooling down the cooling down the compressed air with the help of water jacket. Five bar, after that, the, uh, the five bar of pressure is going to the high pressure compressor throughout which the 30 bar compressed compressed air will get at the after cooler point. At after cooler, we are again cooling down the air, air compressed air uh, compressor. Then we get the 30 bar pressure in the air bottle. Mm. If we are get uh, using intercools in uh, intercooler or after cooler, because uh, we get the Higher mass, I think. Uh, mm -hmm. Higher, uh, high amount of uh, air in the air bottle. A high amount well of air at the low temperature. Mm -hmm. And as well as this, uh, the amount of uh, work done reduced because of multi stage yes. compressor. Okay. Yes. Uh, yes. Evito, you wanna add something? For now, if you can, you know, specify exactly which area of the graph is reducing for the work done, that will be good. Else, not in, important um, if you get this, confused. This, uh, after intercooler, this is uh, reducing now uh, because of the intercooler. Uh, after first bottle, after five bar, it is reducing now. As uh, as I can remember this graph. Yeah, that uh, slope as you mentioned reduces slightly lower, so the area of the total space reduces, which means total work done is less. And then you can also mention that one thing that you have to keep in mind is if you're using double stage, mm -hmm. it's always good to also add an after cooler to increase your air density. Mm -hmm. Okay. The next question is: uh, Are anyone having a pen and paper? Kamlesh, bro. Amston, you are having pen and paper? Yes, yes. Okay. Uh, can you drop PV curve of multi stage air compressor? Yes, yes. Kamlesh, bro, I want you to draw and explain by sharing a screen. Can you do that? We can discuss that graph. Avito will, uh, is also here. If you are having the notes of it, you can also share that. Okay, on screen, uh, so that we can see and have an idea what actually it is. Amston, guys, anyone else wanna draw on paper PV diagram of uh, this uh, multi-stage air compressor? You can. Raj, you can try. I am pausing the meeting. So, I am standing. Okay, 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 okay. You can see? No, no, no. I, I can't see. From. Uh, 
network can is ex- can can you explain okay now now can see now can see can you explain how is uh, without showing what actually it is happening from 1 to 2 2 to 3 3 to 4 okay now now can see just stay uh, little okay. uh, just uh, put this uh, little away from cap little when i will say No, 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 yeah, now can see from P 1 to okay. 2, 2 to 3, 3 to 4 and 4 to 5. So, this portion is work. Uh, 1 to 2 is suction. Hmm. Suction in the first stage of the compressor, wherein hmm. suction is produced. So, the volume increases. Hmm. While we have from 2 to 3, the isentropic compression taking place in the first stage of the compressor. Then we have the 3 to 4 showing the intercooler, wherein the volume decreases hmm. as well as the temperature reduces. Hmm. And also we have that the second stage, so the from 5 bar it increases to 30 bar, mm-hmm. so isentropic compression from 4 to 5, while we have from 5 to 6 the after cooler, mm-hmm. which cools the fluid after the second stage of compression. So this is how a PEP diagram of a air compressor. Okay, goes. I want you to uh, send the picture of this on group, okay? Let okay, 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 okay. 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 Yeah, Raj, uh, uh, do you want to say something? Uh, want to ask something? You raised hand. Kamlesh bro, can we move ahead or you are showing? Okay, let's move ahead. Uh, you sent that picture uh, on group, na? We don't have that much time. Uh, so the next question is, wor- wor- working of compressor and its parts. So anyone want to explain wor- working of compressor, how the compressor works? Just uh, what Amston said it while uh showing the graph that that is how the compressor works anyone else come let's bro i'm audible guys raj can you hear me okay 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 yeah now you uh yeah it's so clear, here's clear. diagram of multi-stage compressor, thematic diagram. Okay, okay. 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 So, so first component is mm-hmm. air filter. Mm-hmm. So, which, whatever air is being sucked in, it passes through the filter, so the debris can be removed. Then it enters the low pressure uh, cylinder. Inlet valve opens. Air is sucked in. Inlet valve closes. Air is compressed. Then the exhaust valve is opened and the uh, compressor is then fed to the intercooler. Uh, in, intercooler is just type of uh, heat exchanger. So can you, uh, can you explain while, while showing that, like uh, while showing this is the air cooler and okay. because your picture is yeah. clearly, yeah. Uh, okay, hmm. so where, where I was, okay. Uh. So this valve will be open, air will be sucked in, hmm. then the piston will move upward and the air will be compressed. Then the exhaust valve or delivery valve will be open. Okay, for the like sake of the compressor, we'll cap, uh, we will call it as a delivery valve. Mm-hmm. Is it right, Gap? Mm-hmm. Discharge valve. Every two. Uh, also keep an eye. Okay. okay. Yeah, yeah. So uh, then the air is fed to the intercooler, which uh, in which it cools down. Okay. Then this cooled air. Cool, but pressure is there. Then mm. is then enters the high pressure cylinder where it will be compressed from, like let's say five bar to the thirty bar. Okay. Mm. Uh, then similar procedure happens here. Then this uh, air is then goes to the after cooler where it again cool and then again and then it is stored in the bottom. So this is the working of compressor. And uh, uh, below you have uh, drawn this PV diagram. Can you show that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Uh, yeah. I have shared the uh, shared it on the group. Yeah. So see, mm. 
uh, at point A. One to two. Yeah, one to two air is droning. Then at two to three, uh, this is the first stage of compression mm -hmm. where the pressure is built up from the like mm -hmm. zero, one to five bar. Mm -hmm. okay. After that, uh, one to two is see, suction. There is uh, suction at constant pressure. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. Then two to three. Uh, this is isentropic compression okay uh, and then this 3 to 4 this pressure is constant and volume is decreasing it is what isobaric heat rejection because of the intercooler that is type of heat exchanger right. hmm. am i right yes yes yes, yes. Yeah. so uh, if you are not using the intercooler hmm. we have to follow the path like this Mm. Okay. Mm. So by incorporating the intercooler in the system, we are saving this much of work. Correct. So that's why we prefer two-stage or multi-stage compressors over single-stage compressors. Mm. Okay. Mm -hmm. From uh, four to five, again it is going uh, in the second yeah. bottle and uh, isentropic or uh, in the second stage compression is from five bar to thirty bar like that. Then yeah. again after cooler. Then, okay, got it. Right. So this was. Uh, yeah. I I don't think after cool is considered in this diagram. No, that constant pressure, uh, just like uh, the last uh, constant pressure heat rejection, Five to six. in which volume is uh, decreasing. The last okay. step. Okay. That is that okay, is okay. just after cooler, na? Okay, okay, okay. So let's move with the, the then we have discussed this question uh, working of com compressor and PV diagram. All right. Let's move with the next question. Which type of compressor is used on board ship and why? I want you to in uh, this uh, Raj, you are to go ahead. Roshan, Srikanth, Vaisak, Vihan, Prem, Manjunath, Sai Prasad, Harish Chandra, Harish. Guys, come up. My question is which type of compressor we used on board ship and why? Any idea? Any idea? Any idea? Raj, you want to tell something? Amston? A multi stage compressor is used because it's, it is a compact in the size. Mm -hmm. So, is it for the whole ship or just for the air compressor? Gyan? Is it concisely for the air compressor or in. The in question broad? is which type of compressor we used on board ship? Okay. Single so stage, for, multi stage. So of course, multi stage. So for the, Air compressor, we use a reciprocating compressor, so it is mainly uh -huh. used because it produces high pressure. While for a uh, turbocharger, we use a centrifugal type of centrifugal type of compressor. Yeah, it's a centrifugal type of blower. No, you mm -hmm. said what kind of blower? Mm -hmm. So uh, what kind what of type of blower? Yeah, this both. what you would say? What? Abhi Abhito? Yeah, you could say that it's uh, slightly, you know, compressing at the end because uh, it is suck sucking in fresh air and supplying the boost. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Turbo charge. I mean the compressor part, not the turbine. The compressor part. It's I a centrifugal. I would have said uh, uh, this thing, uh, this uh, reciprocating multi-stage compressor for cranking the engine, and this in turbocharger we have a centrifugal compressor. No, you said what what type of compressor, no? Type of compressor. Ah. You can't say multi-stage compressor, no? So single multi stage, stage is further part of it. No? Single stage and multi-stage is also type of compressor in the classification of compressor. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. okay. Comrades brother, what would you would have said? Uh, also keeping in mind that you are asked why say, also. Uh, why, why? Which will be used as air compressor and compressing uh, 
uh, like air or engine like that yeah so this is because uh, obviously instead of using a regular hello mm -hmm. hello can you hear me? yes uh, we can hear you yes 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 go on mm -hmm. yeah uh, so uh, so i was saying uh, instead of using a single stage compressor uh, we are using multi stage compressor to save a lot of work uh, by incorporating the intercooler and another thing is uh, yeah i think that's the only answer i have yeah i would have said this why uh, avito and this why even else. why is that because of in a uh, second is multi stage compressor uh, we will be getting the more amount of air in the air bottle the red uh, the less amount of power we need to consume uh, uh, this is the thing what uh, this will not make sense avito can also looks like your screen was frozen for some second i was saying that in a case of why why we are using this so uh, we will say like we use multi stage compressor we use it because the more amount of air we get in air bottle uh, in the finally and as well as the less amount of uh, this uh, the less amount of power is used the power consumption is less as compared to single stage and it is compact uh multi stage uh, for if we have to use single stage compressor then the compressor bottle will be a large size this can be till na yeah also the fact that since you have two different stages you can use two different values so if you want a 7 to 8 bar mm. you can use that separately and you can use your 30 bar uh, separately as your starting motor but most of the pneumatics etc for valves etc cannot operate at 30 bar mm. so they can use the 7 bar line oh really that's can be done also yeah yeah this is the benefit of technical discussion guys and most of the guys is not taking part no worries uh, uh, from the next session you guys also take part we do is it possible like that from the first stage we we can direct it like that or is it from the air regulator after the this air bottle It can be di differ from manufacturer to manufacturer, but mm. I've seen some people do that. Yeah, for okay, pneumatic okay, okay, system, okay. for uh, like uh, for operating uh, pneumatic cleaning and all, we can use this uh, first stage compressor air, na compressed air. Don't know. Uh, it's uh, just a speculation from my side. Okay. The next question. Let's move ahead with the next question. That. uses of compressed air on ship very simple we have discussed lots of time anyone want to go ahead so yeah, we use just... it for the yeah come let's go on yeah yeah go ahead, go ahead. so we use it for the uh, actuation of the pneumatic pneumatic valves and also we use it for cranking the engine for the initial start mm. like 30 bar pressure is sent like 23 to 30 bar pressure is sent mm. and also it can be used for some some kind of cleaning on the deck so these are the uses of the compressed air on board ship yeah any add up i wait to from your side i wait to and kamlesh brother uh I don't have any add up, but I would like to structure it in this way. Okay. First of all, we need a compressor for uh, cranking of our engines. Okay. Second thing is we need to and uh, we need compressor to operate all the pneumatic systems present on board. And third thing, we use this uh, like compressor to drive our pneumatic tools. Hmm. Making sense. Yeah, sounds good. Sounds. Uh, anyone else, guys? Guys, yeah, is it, yeah, yeah, yeah. Is it used for reversing also? Air is used for this compressed air is used for reversing the engine also. I have read it somewhere. Yeah, that comes under cranking only, right? So yeah, yeah, yeah. whether you crank it in the first position or second position depends where you position the uh, piston. No, I mean actually he is talking about that. Uh, you know, cam profile changes. Like uh, yeah. okay, okay. Before See, the cam yeah. profile changes. So for activation of that stuff. 
we also use compressor it has a pneumatic system or hydraulic system depends on the manufacturer yeah because when we are reversing the engine okay we are just up moving the opposite side in the proper uh, the direction of propeller will be in opposite side now which is connected to crank shaft so uh, we will mm -hmm. be cranking in opposite direction maybe yes exactly yeah and the last question is we which we have already discussed many time in this session why two stage air compressor is used uh, we just skip it <laughs> <laughs> anyone else guys guys you can try to speak up and let's see your answer is correct or not let's see if you can speak up if you are not here speaking up how you are supposed to speak up in front of interview be shameless like me i don't know anything <laughs> then only i keep speaking up i keep on speaking <laughs> store high pressure air in the air body to store high pressure in the uh, high pressured air in the air bottle yeah high pressurized air in the air bottle uh, as you told the users right before yeah like uh, if it would be single stage compressor from uh, one bar to making 30 bar air pressure it would have require a large of power and a large cylinder okay but uh, yes. uh, using two stage compressor we can easily manage to uh, secure this high pressure air in a high amount okay by uh, uh, using less power using a compact type compressor yeah uh, we'll try it uh, vihan when is your ims interview yeah it's scheduled on 4 okay uh, i am so uh, having on 4 most guys yeah yeah, yeah. kamlesh yes yeah. on your day right Okay. My number was it's twenty three. Okay. Okay. So Vihan, you keep your preparing, and after thirty yes. first, schedule or mocks with Avito. Okay. Yeah. I am working yeah. on it after the pack. Yeah, yeah. yeah uh, because uh, and also see the earlier mocks on our platform what it is. Okay. Because the confidence, the thing you don't need to be blank. Just you tried now. This is okay. Yes. Okay. If you get blank in the front of interviewer, it will be a negative point, and the moment he will re realize that uh, he is not enough confident to get into it. Already enough competition. So to, uh, keep your preparation high and ask for mock. Okay. Yes, definitely. So we are done with the compressor yes. question. I am going to stop this recording, and now we will be uh, discussing boiler question. Oh. Uh, when the next yeah. recording? Yes. Uh, before you we move on to the next question i would like to add one single question yeah yeah uh, what's the difference your voice gone your voice gone guys anyone can hear kamlesh bro oh god Uh, maybe then you can say when what it was, comes what was the in terms of question? centrifugal. What was the original question, guys? Sorry for just had a call because of that I get out of the meeting. What was the question? He was asking what about difference of uh, centrifugal uh, this compressor and pump a centrifugal, and centrifugal pump. pump or let's say uh, like reciprocating pump and reciprocating compressor. In uh, pump we have flu liquid. thing uh, in compressor we have uh, gaseous fluid liquid fluid and gaseous fluid gaseous yeah so this is the basic thing so the uh, are you trying to say that if the rest of the things is quite same what so is the so but how about that priming and all for the centrifugal how about the uh, priming for a centrifugal pump Yeah, so in a centrifugal pump like we are priming, like right? So for centrifugal priming, then cavitation, etc. No, for centrifugal uh, compressor there will be priming. There no, is no. already already air present, right? No, no. See, uh, compressor. <laughs> there is no concept of priming, priming in 
कंप्रेसर आई हैवन हर्ड ऑफ योर कंफ्यूजन इज कंफ्यूजन इज सॉल्व पैनिंग इज ओके सो व्हाट यू आर टॉकिंग अबाउट इज पर्जिंग आई थिंक पर्जिंग इज द रिलीजिंग ऑफ एयर एवेटो इज इन पर्जिंग इज द रिलीजिंग ऑफ एयर लाइक वाइल ओपनिंग द एयर वेंट कॉक इन अ केस ऑफ बॉयलर Part- in some cases but it is also similar to priming in this case as per what uh, amson is talking about hmm. okay uh, so let's move on to the next question and if anyone finds anything more about this hmm. just post well, it on the question uh, okay. yeah okay. well definitely so this was the additional question now let me write this okay So what was then what about parts they are not mention about parts yeah, yeah, parts, parts. Of the, parts of the compressor parts of a air compressor parts of air compressor yeah, yeah. yes guys go ahead oh yeah right please keep the question right hmm. and then yeah you can go ahead come let's go okay so a normal comp- uh, like Typically, compressor has a component similar to the ice engine, like a crankcase, mm-hmm. then a crankshaft, mm-hmm. then a connecting rod, mm-hmm. piston, the piston liner, piston rings, mm-hmm. and valves. And in case of multi-stage compressors, uh, you will have intercooler and aftercooler mm-hmm. in addition to these things. Mm-hmm. In the case of centrifugal compressor, okay. One more important thing is a uh, air filter. Uh, in a case of centrifugal compressor, the centrifugal compressor has a casing, turbine, impeller, inducer. It has a casing, a uh, turbine. Casing, impeller, inducer, diffuser. I don't think I have crossed it. These are the things in a centrifugal compressor. Okay. Mostly reciprocating compressor is the general so compressor. What is the <coughs> the impeller in centrifugal compressor there is a impeller and there is a diffuser there is a inducer as well in a case of turbocharger uh, the compressor part contains these things recently we studied about this so uh, you are also la- uh, right uh, any add up really... yeah. yes amstan uh, again actually what what yeah, you said about say... the centrifugal compressor no? can you just put it on the uh, chat box I cannot hear it. I will send the whole picture. Okay, uh, the parts and picture with the name. Let okay, no problem. Okay, yeah. Have we to any add up? What would? Uh, But yeah, centrifugal so compressor some... won't be asked. No, it won't be asked because no, 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 it is no, not no, using no. air compressor. Right? No, no. Centrifugal no. compressor. It. No. It won't. It But, won't. Uh, it doesn't no. develop that know, much pressure. But you know. But you know. It won't power. be asked. Okay. I haven't heard of like uh, going yeah, in. Yeah. Yeah. But better to be on a safer side. Yeah, Evito. Yeah, all good for now. Okay. So, any one else want to add any question, additional question regarding compressor? Guys, Vijay Vihan, Syed West, Roshan, Prem, Haris, Ashok. Any question regarding uh, uh, compressor? Anything you want to ask again? If any concept you didn't understand. understand like multi stage compressor wow, which compressor we used on board ship what is meant by two stage compressor anything so we can wind up with this compressor part uh, air compressor part and we will be moving on the next part okay uh, all good kamlesh bro avito so uh, yeah Yes, so, all good, all good. Okay, so guys, this was the IMS Goa related questions. That is, uh, that is of compressor, air compressor. From air compressor, this much question till now, uh, from the testimonial we got and we just discussed this. Okay, and since knowledge is universal, you can refer this video, this technical session for every type of interview. Most of the questions are common and same. Thank you, thank you, guys. I am just putting on the record. of the recording putting off recording okay